So if you are watching this video, I'm guessing you have just joined Mum Club. So hello, welcome. Um, how many days have you been tired for now? I've been tired for 315 days. And you've been not tired for 315 days. <laughs> so yeah, I'm joining you like this. We're in this together. So this right. is minimum effort, maximum output beauty tips that are really going to help on a day-to-day -day basis make you feel a bit more like you. When I first had night, I can't even explain to you how ill I look. My body was really dark and my face was white because all your vitamins drain, all your colour drains. Something like this is such a game changer. So get yourself some tan drops. This is a small size because I've tried so many tan drops. To be honest, most of the time I don't like it. They look patchy, they look gross, they don't go for my skin tone. But you can see I've nearly used this all up and I will be getting the big version. Mix a few drops of this in with your moisturiser, depends on how tan you want to be. You can pop it on overnight and then wake up and you feel so much better you don't have to put foundation on if you don't want my other secret product is this and i always get new mums ask how you stop yourself from looking so tired this is the answer um it is bobby brown corrector you can pop it on before your concealer i'll pop it on here look at the difference that makes the tiniest tiniest little bit and then you can follow up with a concealer it takes seconds and it makes such a difference so if you don't want to wear foundation, get yourself some of this. This is like a skin gloss, so it makes your skin look like when you've applied all your serums and everything, and you look lovely and like dewy. It's like that, but for a long time. Okay, so when it comes to skin, you need something that's transfer resistant because you've got your baby on you, they're touching your face all the time. If you have skin products on, it will come off on their clothes, which are sometimes lovely and white and they get ruined, um, and it comes off on their skin too. Like Fenty Beauty, um, Double Wear, Estee Lauder Double Wear, something like that. It doesn't necessarily have to be heavy, you can wear Estee Lauder Double Wear Light. Um, and you can just gently buff it onto the face and that's not going to come off on their um, clothes or their skin. Get yourself some Wonder Brow. This does not come off until you have to forcibly remove it. Use a really thin brush. It's just a little liquid. And just sort of use it on the areas where you want it. This will not come off. So you can literally leave it overnight. It's not going to transfer. Your brows will be fine in the morning. It will literally last days. If you're somebody that needs to have their eyebrows on. And they like to have their eyebrows on all the time. I used to walk around with my hair like this this is the mum hair mum fun it's off your face and it's lovely but the problem is when you take it out your hair is like kinky it's horrible so if you want to pop somewhere and you don't want to have your mum bun in it's then a challenge to make it look nice so the mum bun is a vicious cycle if you just pop it as if you were doing a low bun and use something that's not going to kink it so use a little clip or something like that your hair's off your face but you take it out it will have somewhat of like a blow dried effect to it rather than having all the kinks of a mum bun also for mums that have lost their front bits so you get these little tufts that grow back but they fall out first um something to do with your hormones at about four or five months I live on this, so this is just a coloured root spray and it basically, I just used to fill in the root area and it would just make your hair look much fuller up where um, your hair had sort of fallen out a bit. You probably all know this, nipple cream. It makes a great lip moisturiser, which is obviously not going to affect a lot of baby's skin. So as always guys, if you like this, please like, comment, share, subscribe and yeah, say bye mummies.